all in lifts. I've seen one of those before. It's a very generic brand, but... Yeah, it's very generic. Look at this. It is very generic. But I like that. It is hydraulic, so maybe that's good motor? Yeah, it is a really okay motor, not gonna lie. No pre doors, sadly. Door close button doesn't work. Where are we, America? Jeez. Door close button doesn't work. Look at the indicator, it's so freaking generic. It even takes a lot of. Wait a minute. There's someone who wants to go in. So we're ready for it to come down again. Because I'm not done yet. Let's see, it does have a chassis, uh, kind of. I don't know. But watch from upstairs. Maybe I can see if it has a chassis. See if the door close button works now. Door open, door close. No, the close button is just there for no reason. It just doesn't work. Very useless. And press zero again as well. So when we go out, we can check the lift going down. Because like I said, I'm really interested in seeing if it has a chassis or not. I don't know why, I just want to see. just want to see how, how well this one is built. It has no chassis at all. <laughs> it's actually very interesting to look at that. You can see the inspection control up there, I think. Is it inspection? I don't even know if it is. Look, when it's in motion, the button starts to flash. Which is interesting. And the close button still doesn't work. How amazing. It didn't build this lift very well. Door close button doesn't even work. It is a really good leveling for a, for a uh, generic. But that's all I can say about that. Because it's generic. Nothing more, nothing less. It takes a long while for the door to close as well. Stand back for the thumbnail. Bam. And that's it.